gasoline I smell? Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel guys, I hope you all are doing amazing as always and it's me Joe as always and today guys I want to talk about the movie called Violent Night. This is a new uh, thriller kind of movie about Christmas, uh, you know, because holidays are upon us and uh, so as Christmas movie are upon us, you know, and this one is not your typical Christmas movie. This one is with David Harbour as Santa Claus. And this movie essentially is like if Die Hard and Home Alone combined, this is the kind of movie that, uh, you know, you would get. And we got it. And I gotta say, when I saw the first trailer, I was really excited for this movie because it just looked pretty interesting and just like sort of a dumb fun and uh, you know David Harbour coming off Stranger Things you know uh, doing like something else you know the last time he did something else that ended up being pretty poor I'm talking about obviously uh, the Hellboy reimagining that was absolutely fucking terrible if you ask me and now he's done this this the violent night the movie essentially is about a family and uh, these evil people uh, break into their house and uh, Santa Claus comes uh, to rescue them essentially and he's killing them the not the family but the bad guys and I was honestly really surprised by this. This is genuinely a really entertaining movie, you know? David Harbour as Santa Claus is really, really, really good, you know? I think that he's got the charm, he's got... He's like this... This Santa Claus is like depressed almost, you know? He's like drunk and he's like very like nihilistic and stuff. He's just not really a happy person. But um, then he uh, finds out about what happens, what happened, and he, obviously he wants to help. And yeah, guys, I, I actually really enjoy this one, you know, a lot more than I expected. Um, the action is pretty cool. Now, I gotta say that this movie is R-rated, which is something that I didn't know coming into the movie. And I was actually very surprised by that, because the movie is actually really, really cool when it comes to the R-rating, you know? Because I was expecting this to be maybe something like, uh, you know, Krampus, the, the Krampus movie that came out a, a few years ago, which that movie, it's not really comparable, but they are both like Christmas uh, movies, but I was expecting that movie to be R-rated, but it wasn't, and this one is, which is really, really cool, and that obviously really helps the action, and it just works really, really good, it works so much better than if this movie was, uh, if this movie would have been, uh, you know, PG-13 or whatever. And I, again, I really, really enjoy this one. This is definitely sort of that enjoyable movie. You just, you know, you grab a popcorn, uh, nachos, whatever you like, whatever you prefer. You sit down and you watch a fun movie. This is exactly that. And again, I have to say that I was genuinely surprised by how, by how entertaining this movie really is. It's really entertaining, it's real fun, and yeah, it just works really well, it's really enjoyable, everybody did a great job. I really enjoyed David Harbour's portrayal of Santa Claus as this de depressed individual, you know, the, 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 this Santa is not, like, not that sort of like happy Santa, you know, like Santa Claus that is like, sort of like, we know, kind of like. This Santa is just like, you know, so sort of like giving up on life almost, but then he's like, oh my gosh, I have to help them, and uh, then the story unfolds more and more, and yeah, it's really entertaining, it's like if you, if you would have combined uh, Die Hard and Home Alone, but instead of Kevin, you get Santa Claus, and uh, yeah, instead of like a big building that's... Uh, you know, collapsing, kind of, you have this house of this family. Really entertaining movie, really great movie, really enjoyable one, and just something that I really, really enjoyed, and I highly recommend you guys seeing the movie. By the way, if you've seen the movie, let me know down below your thoughts about it, because, again, I want to know, because it's entertaining, and I really enjoyed it more than I expected. 
Anyway, guys, that's all for this review. I'll see you next one. Take care as always, and bye.